Now, the city manager says this has been a contentious issue that has divided the community. On one hand, some residents say this type of breed restriction is needed. On the other hand, the animal shelter that serves the city of Gross Point Shores is now threatening to end its contract over these new rules. Well, the ordinance, what it does is it bans pit bulls from coming into the city. Gross Point Shores City Manager Stephen Poloni says the city recently passed a pit bull ban after a couple and their dog were attacked by one back in June. The pit bull attack happened near the corner of Lockmore and Sunningdale. Poloni says this has been a tough issue to deal with. You know, the community has been passionate about this issue, uh, somewhat divided. Uh, current dog owners that have pit bulls that are licensed will be able to keep their dogs. The pit bull was reportedly owned by Detroit Lions running back David Montgomery. The dog that was attacked had its leg amputated and its owner suffered minor injuries. Montgomery's pit bull was euthanized. It's happened to me when I was walking my dog. This woman who did not want to be identified says her dog was attacked by a pit bull that got out of its yard in another city. I've had another pit bull come after me and attack my dog while I was walking them, walking them along the street. That said, she is for the recently passed pit bull ban, but not everyone agrees. The Gross Point Animal Adoption Society, the shelter that serves Gross Point Shores, is threatening to end its contract with the city over these new rules. And at last night's city council meeting, more than 300 people signed a petition opposing the pit bull ban. Many voices objected to singling out pit bulls. And this woman admits it doesn't feel right singling out a specific breed, but the data speaks for itself. She says pit bulls are dangerous. It's sad to stereotype, but that's generally what it is. Now moving forward, there is still lots of question on how the city plans to enforce this new breed restriction. Meanwhile, David Montgomery, the Lions running back, is still facing a civil lawsuit over this matter. In Gross Point Shores, Gino Vici, CBS News, Detroit.